On question number five, we want to find the coordinates of the vertices of the figure after the transformation. And for this transformation, we're going to reflect across the line y equal one. Remember that when you have y equal a number, you're going to start by finding that number on the y axis. So y equal one is right here. And then y equal lines are horizontal lines. So we're going to draw a dotted line right there. And that's my reflection line. Now I just flip the points across that line. Notice how point U is right on the reflection line. When something's on your reflection line and you flip it across, it's still going to stay in the same spot. So the coordinates of U are 1, 1, and the coordinates of U prime are also 1, 1. The other two points, though, are not on my reflection line, so they're going to move. Notice how W is 1 below my line. So W prime is just going to be 1 above my reflection line. And the coordinates there are 1, 2, 3, 4 for the x and 1, 2 for the y. So w prime would be at 4, 2. And then I'll go back and look at v. You can see that v is 1, 2, 3 above my reflection line. So v prime just needs to be 3 below, 1, 2, 3. And we'll make a dot right there. And that is v prime. So V prime's coordinates would be at three, negative two. And again, U prime, because it's on the reflection line, it just stays in the same spot. Now you can see when I connect these and form my triangle, it looks like it's the same shape and same size. It's just been flipped across the reflection line.